I just changed my rates on the Avada and you can see them here. Everything is 160, 500 and 0.54 and it feels super, super good right now. I didn't have any problems. It's a little windy, not too bad. Nothing that I was worried about, but it just felt really smooth. I felt like I had a lot more control. So uh, I made a video before about some mistakes I fixed and one of them was changing my rates and that was good for a while, but then eventually I said, how can I make it a little better? I found it on liftoff. Uh, it was like a DJI Avada simulator. They don't have the actual drone on liftoff, but someone like custom made one and this was the rates they had. And I didn't even realize that. I was like, this smells a little different. So I checked the settings and it changed the rates. So like, you know what? I like it on liftoff. I'm gonna try it on the drone. I'm pretty impressed guys, I really am. I've had a problem where this drone just kind of just turns on its own and it just throws itself in the ground. It honestly might be user error. It's most likely user error. It feels like I threw myself in the ground. Maybe now with these better rates, I can feel more control, maybe make a little better uh, movements in my head and whatnot. Really fun flight here in White Sands and Kodiak. Just took the dogs out for a little sunset. I thought it'd be a nice sunset, but then the clouds came back in and now it's just cloudy. I am not a flipper, a trickster with this thing. I don't think the Avada is made for that. I think you can do it. I just don't think the Avada is built for tricks. I think it's a cinematic drone. And by cinematic drone, I just mean it's a drone that's not meant to do those kind of moves. It's just smoother, maybe some dives. They did some dives, the dives felt pretty good. Thought that was kind of cool. Alrighty guys, well I just got home and uh, it got super foggy. It's pretty dark right now. The sunset's still in like 20 more minutes, but the fog is just th so thick, it's not worth flying. The footage will be pretty dark. And uh, just the shadows and the trees are just so dark and everything, so it's not worth flying. But anyway, uh, there's no need to make this video any longer than it has to be. So, those are my new rates. 
hopefully they work for you they felt pretty good for me i'll leave a link to the drone that i used on liftoff in the simulator because it feels just like it in real life i'll leave you with a playlist right here of my full dji avada footage from day one all the way up to today hope you guys enjoy it other than that catch you in the next one feeling good every time i fly and don't crash i feel just a little bit better